Eric, you gaslight me really well. Oh, maybe. Do you want to share your rice purity score? It's like a three. P.O. boy, Christian boy. Of course. They don't know. I haven't gotten into a fight either. You're going to lose every time. What do you mean? Of course you haven't. So today's video, we're going to be asking my guy friends questions that you wouldn't ask yours. But honestly, it's a bunch of randomly mixed questions, so I'm just going to change it to interrogating my guy friends. As you're watching this video, if you are like, wow, I can ask such better and juicier questions, honestly, comment them down below and we can make a part two if you guys like this series. I have a lot of guy friends that we can ask juicier questions to. For this week, these were the friends that were free and were able to film with me. Just a disclaimer, I told all of them if they were uncomfortable answering any questions, they can just tell me and they don't have to answer it at all. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hey guys, this is... Josh. Josh! Wow, Josh Paul Craddock. Yes, hey, give man. it up. Whenever I introduce you to people, I say my 6'4 friend. How do you introduce me? The short girl. Exactly. The short, so it's fine. We're in the same grade and stuff. We play clarinet together. We're always like a chair yeah. next to each other. Senior year, he beat me. Kudos to him. Yes, finally. finally after four years. I also just gave up that semester, hey. but it's fine. Hey. No, you deserved it though. Okay, Sean. Even if I tried harder, I probably wouldn't have beat him. Hey guys, we're here with. Eric. <laughs> Are you camera shy? A little bit. As you all know, this is Eric. We love Eric. He was one of my clarinets when I was a section leader. Now I'm not a section leader anymore. He's gonna be a sophomore. He's still doing band. Good job. Mm -hmm. Proud of you. Oh my gosh, you have so why are all your rings on one hand? Why I'm getting more. <laughs> they're they're all, all on they're one hand. All You're okay with being on camera, right? Somewhat. Because he said yes. I asked him to. I didn't force him to make a video. Just making that clear. Hey guys, this is... Michael. Yes, he's... I almost said an all-star. Wait. All-stater? All-stater, yeah. yeah! For background, we met in 8th grade in English class. And we stayed friends all throughout high school. Even though we didn't go to the same high school. The first question. Peaches or cherries, metaphorically? Huh, cherries. <laughs> Not, not in that way, not in that way though. Wait, not in that way? I thought he was coming out. Pride month! No. <laughs> not you. a deal breaker, not a deal breaker, but it matters. Yeah. Okay. Thank you for the contact. Uh, I have no opinion. No opinion? Aw, so respectful. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter? Yeah, that's not my, that's not my thing. It doesn't matter. It doesn't yes, matter. Yes, queen. Okay. Slay. Slay. <laughs> what matters most when getting a significant other? Boyfriend or girlfriend? What do you mean matters most? Like for me, I would want someone to take care of me well and to know how to handle my anxiety attacks. Okay, that's deep. Physical attraction gets you in the door, but like the personality makes you want to stay. In the end, personality, but to get in the door, you need physical attraction. Yeah, that kind of makes sense. I think there's an equal balance. Mm, taking care of them. Taking care of them? Aw, that's Seeing a sweet how answer. They how they treat me and how they make me feel. Deep. Uh -huh. Do you find periods disgusting? I mean, no. It's just blood. Bl I've bled before. <laughs> no, because my mom's going to get mad that I asked that question. Oh my gosh, Shanta. How dare you? No, like my mom would hide pads from my brother and be like, don't let him look at it. From V? Yeah. <laughs> That's funny. And I was like, well, he was in health science and anatomy, so he kind of had to learn about it. My mom would be picking food in the grocery store. She'd be like, hey, son, go get me pads. And I was like, seven. Really? Yeah. Dang. I was like, what color box? <laughs> <laughs> I'm not talking about used. How about clean? I want someone to say they're disgusting so we can so, <laughs> so they can get attacked in the comments. Okay. No. It's just it literally no, because it just no. happened. We're being very they're elaborate. So, they're so natural and they're natural. Natural queen. <laughs> natural queen. Have you ever wanted to get into a physical fight and why? Huh, yeah. Really? Bro, people be annoying. I could <laughs> I could beat 99% of the people I find annoying. True. I could beat them to a pull. I'm 6'4". I'm like, I'm hitting the gym. <laughs> That's your personality trait, being 6'4". That's six my personality four. trait. I haven't, I haven't fought, though. I've never gotten into one. I've wanted okay. to. I haven't gotten into a fight either. Yeah, no. <laughs> You're going to lose every time. What do you mean? Of course you haven't. <laughs> for your reason for fighting, though, like, mm -hmm. do you actually want a reason for fighting? Or do you be like, oh my god, it'd be so cool to just fight someone out of the blue? No, I want a reason. Okay. There's no there's no point to fight someone out of the blue. That's just, that's just stupid. I'm like an actual fight, like a pillow fight with the boys. That'd be fun. Pillow fight with the boys? Pillow fight with the boys. Not homosexual. Homosexual. Quite a few times. Actually, you've actually wanted to get into fights? 
are you talking about random fights or do you want to fight for a reason? So like, let's say, cause he has a girlfriend, right? I keep mentioning that, right? So let's say like, there's this person that's like bullying her, that's supposedly a guy, you know? Like, would you want to fight him? Of course. Of course! I thought you'd be like, okay, let's sit down, talk about it. No, you're just gonna straight up fight them, right? Shut them up. <laughs> would you want to fight for a reason or it's just random for fun? Both. Both. Mm. Well, yeah. But why? I don't know. There are reasons, but I probably wouldn't be able to explain them. That Girlfriend, looks... girlfriend's ex. Oh. He was a poopy oh. guy. So you would fight to yeah. protect someone, but not yeah. necessarily for fun. No, not for fun. Okay, because I know guys are like, oh, I want to fight for fun. I don't want to fight for fun. I would break things for fun. You should go to a rec room. Yes. Yeah. Okay, future video. <laughs> what is the longest you've gone without showering? When I was hiking, probably like a week. It's actually a really common answer. Yeah. For me, it would be like during band trips when everyone would take too long in the showers and they'd be like, That's like two off. days. That's like two days. I know. So oh it wasn't God. that bad. You yeah, know, I was hiking in the wilderness and I couldn't shower for like a week. Oh. It was pretty fun. I've never hiked or camped. Really? Because my parents don't like it. A week? A week. No water. Oh, was that during the freeze? Yeah. Oh, I was lucky enough to have water. But I didn't have electricity. Oh, have you ever been camping? Yeah, I've been camping for like a week before, so... But like, showers included or no? No. Any way I could get myself clean would be like in a river. Wow. Yeah. I could never do that. Yeah, I know. No. Uh, do you know what the five love languages are? Do you know which one you are? Probably a touch. Really? Yeah. Gifts are like... Yeah. Materialistic service. I just do service with my with my boys. Like not not in that way, but like <laughs> anyone anyone can like be friendly to me and like help me out. Praise. I mean, I guess. I gave a quick lesson to Eric about the five love languages, and he says he's a mix. Yeah, I'm kind of mixed between them. Do you have like any specific ones you mixed with? Like affirmation, words of affirmation, and quality time. Touch and also buying people stuff. What is mine? Acts of service. That one's mine, I think. I just like buying people like gifts. Really? Yeah, I like spending my money on people. What is your biggest insecurity? My weight. I've been fat all my life. Oh my gosh, you yeah. actually answered that really fast. Yeah. I instantly, my weight. Yeah, I have like certain shirts that I can't wear outside because they're not flattering to me. I'm like, uh. I did not expect that. Yeah, I'm working on it though. I'm going to the gym. I'm running. Good job. Clap up for job. Wait, that sounds weird. Yeah, no, don't say clap up. <laughs> don't say that. I don't know. You don't know? Or are you I just like confident it. in everything or like... I'm not confident either, but I, I, I just don't think about it. I would say like my face is mine. Or like my acne or my nose or like my arms now. Just basically everything. Is that a deep question? Uh, not really. Not for me. I don't like my nose. I think my nose is like too big. I don't like my nose either. Or my face because my face... I just have a lot of acne that I haven't been able me to clean too, up. Me too, Queen. It's okay. Because in middle school, people would be like, pepperoni face. And I'd be like, oh my god. And now high school, no one cares. Yeah, because we all get acne in high school. Exactly. What's the funniest joke that you can think of right now? This is a really cheesy one from like second grade. That's 10 years ago. That's crazy. Oh my god. More than 10 years ago. Knock, knock. Who's there? Who? Who? Huh? Who? Oh, are you an owl? Oh my Who? god. Going, but yeah, I it's thought a it'd be joke. different. Since you told me a joke, I'll tell you a joke. Oh no. What do you call a fish without eyes? <laughs> Dang it! No. I just saw a video of doing that. I just Wait, saw a video. Ryan yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, bonding. One cent, oh one cent around the country. It would be racist, but. Oh, Eric! <laughs> it's funny. I'll cut it out, don't worry. Hmm, you sure? Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. He failed to tell me the joke, but he told me about the joke. Okay, Eric. Oh no. <laughs> are you a dad jokes type of person? No, well, dad jokes are puns and I hate puns. My humor is Gen Z humor and that's the thing. So I would just say beans and I'd laugh at that. What is something that I wouldn't believe about you? I didn't want to be a clarinetist. Clarinet was like my last choice. Um, I work? Wow, I I'm so shocked. See, you know me so well though, that's <laughs> the thing. So that's hard. Yeah. I don't think I have anything. Really? Because I feel like you just know me so well that you would just believe anything. Because I've told you like basically. Or I feel like you can guess like me really well. Oh, maybe. <laughs> oh my but... god. If you were a rapper, what would your rapper name be? This is this is the what the heck question. Like yeah. the deep questions and then the what no, the heck question. No, you gotta have a mix. Probably like Big White, I guess. I don't know. 
Oh, I was gonna say Little Shanti. Little Shanti? He's a little yeah. Shanti. <laughs> Shanti's a good name for a rap name. It's like, if I were to be a rapper, I would be called Little Shanti. <laughs> you know, like Little Baby, like, you know I what I mean? Know. You don't know? You don't want to choose one? I don't know. Ooh. Okay, guys, comment down below <laughs> a rapper name for Eric. See, the only thing I have is the whole mayo thing. Well, mayo. Medicated mayo would yeah. be his rapper name. Is cereal a soup? And does pineapple belong on pizza? No and no, what the heck? A soup, a soup <laughs> is cooked, a soup is marinated, a soup has spices True. that to do it. That's an opinion based question. I have no opinion on food like that. I can eat it with or without. For the pineapple and pizza. Okay, so is cereal yeah. a soup? Or do you. Or, would you. It could be. It could be? You're so elaborate, Eric. Thank mm -hmm. you. Thank mm -hmm. you. Mm -hmm. Okay, cereal I constitute as a soup because. Actually? You know how you can have like chicken broth? Yeah. Or you have the cereal sitting in the milk? That uh -huh. becomes cereal broth if you think about it. I think it counts. Would like. A certain amount of time would have to pass in order to count cereal as a soup. Maybe. Do you know what I mean? Uh, so like when you first put it in, it's not cereal broth yet. That's true. We're thinking. Thinking. Mm. Wow. What is the sexiest and least sexiest name you can think of? Least sexiest hunter. Are you oh, talking about like both genders or just go to Oh, you can do either one. It doesn't both matter. Hunter. I have not seen a hot person named Hunter. No offense to any hunters, but like... <laughs> Why should there be like five hunters out there being so offended? Fellas, you need, to, you need to show me some pics. Representation in your name is not good right now. Most sexy? Mm -hmm. Um, can I give a first and last name? Ryan Reynolds. I'm not gay, but he could pull me. Good answer, good answer. I'm not gay, but he could pull me. Any... Eugene? <laughs> As like the sexiest? No. The least sexiest? <laughs> oh! And then... I don't know. Main wood, but no. So you can't think of a sexiest name? I don't think about the names. I just... feel like all your answers are just like, no, no. <laughs> you seem, he seems scared of me. I promise he's not. Oh, that's a good question. I need to think of my answers too. Penelope's not very sexy at all. <gasps> or like Deborah. Oh, Penelope. Oh, Deborah. Yeah. Cause it just sounds like they're like 50. I don't know if I can find the sexiest name though. No, I was kind of expecting you to be like, the least sexiest name is Chantel. I was thinking about and it. And the most sexiest name is Michael. I was thinking about saying your name is the least sexiest though. Do you want to share your rice purity score? It's like a three, man. No, like, I've only gotten like three of them. So you're a 97? 97, yeah. Okay, I thought you meant no, he's no, no. a three. I was like, whoa, you gotta update me on that. I, everyone else, all my friends are like 40, uh, like 50, 60, 70, 50. I'm like 97. Hmm. It's tough. Pure boy, Christian boy. Oh. You don't have to. Do whatever you're comfortable with. I'm saying that for legal reasons. It's, it's under 50. That's all I'm gonna give. 34. <laughs> I told you this the other night. They don't know. What can someone do to make you attracted to them? Laugh. Laugh at my laugh. Just giggle. If you laugh at my jokes, I'm probably gonna fall for you. You're actually answering these pretty fast. Yeah, it's an obvious question, Chantel. <laughs> what makes you attracted to a person? Them liking me? I don't know. The bare minimum. The bare, probably. That sounds really bad. Should I ask you that when you have a girlfriend? That sounds bad. Okay, never mind. Skipping! Honestly, they could just exist. Or I feel like if you can talk to someone and be open to them, then you're, you know. Yeah. That's just my input. Or yeah. like, they look attractive, or they just treat me nice. Bare minimum. The bare minimum, but we're working on it. There are many single people watching this video mm. right now. So, if I, someone- I can get hooked up from your YouTube video and that one angel. Would you want that? With 250 subscribers. How many do you have right now? I haven't checked in a bit. 300. 350? <laughs> I haven't checked in a minute. That one angel. I, know. I, kept I need to work it. on consistency. I kept spreading at that one angle. So if someone out there is interested in you, what would you like to say to them? How you doing? My name's Josh. <laughs> Ew! That's your <laughs> pickup line? Okay. Probably why I don't know how to go, then. Probably why. Do you have a pickup line? No. Oh, wait. Oh, I had one. I had one like two days ago. Let's just change the last question for him since he's taken. What would you like to tell anyone out there? Just anything. Focus on yourself. Focus on yourself. That's pretty on deep. First. That's pretty deep, Eric. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I did that. That is Josh's segment. Woo. You did amazing. I yes. did? Oh, yes. thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you for participating, Josh. Woo! Thank you for having me. Oh my god. Okay. Thank you so much, Eric.
Are you okay? Yeah. You seem really shy. I swear it's just the camera. <laughs> Normally you'd be really loud right now and just chaotic. Now he's like, oh my god. I just go oh. on YouTube. <laughs> Are you okay? We have like a few hundred subscribers. <laughs> Not that many people watch it though. Eric gave consent to filming this, okay? Right? Yeah. It sounds like I'm forcing you. I don't want it to seem like I'm forcing you. Okay, bye guys. Uh, I don't know, hit me up. She'll link my wow. Instagram. So smooth. Link, so smooth it, right there. He'll treat you well. Just no. don't break his heart. And that's all I could ask for. You get mad at them if they broke my heart. Yeah, I'll fight them. Totally. Oh. Uh-huh. Any questions for me before you set off on your own way? And thank you for participating in this <laughs> video. Why? Why? Why, Why? the video? Yes. I don't know. I feel like it's cool content. I'm trying to upload every week. Has it been working? For two weeks so far. Okay. You're trying your best. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Thank you. You're welcome. Yay! I honestly love filming these types of videos. I'm also thinking of doing a girl version of this video, so let me know if you guys want to watch that too. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys enjoyed it, please give it a like and please subscribe because it'll mean the world to me. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys all so much. Peace.